I, I, I also come back to is not only that, uh, you're filling in this gap, but it's also this expertise that's, you know, because as a developer, you look at the tools oftentimes that's provided to you as they exist in their current state. And we get this all the time at Octopus. People will ask for a feature or they'll ask for a change. And it's based on how Octopus Deploy exists at this particular point in time, not what it could potentially look like in the future, not you know how we want to change it. And in fact, we've introduced, uh, when we introduced our project version control, that was meant to solve a number of different problems, but solve it in a different way than what people were asking for. Um, and so again, back to your example of updating these global.asax files, you end up in this very gnarly situation because you're trying to use the tool as it exists today. And so you're coming up with all of these kind of, lack of a better term, kludgy solutions to hopefully get it to work. Um, and unfortunately, when you have a tool that, you know, you are also paying for their expertise to help you solve this particular problem. Um, and you might not even know that there's a different solution, might not even know that there's a better way. All you know is the way that you've done it in the past and your expertise in your own uh, in your own biases on something like that. And so it's kind of like there's that old Simpsons uh, scene where Homer's smashing an orange against his head and Troy McClure says, hey, you know, there's a better way to make orange juice. And Homer's like, there's a better way? Because you just don't know. Um, you don't have that expertise. 